heard that growing three crops together um, gave you some risk mitigation and uh, some opportunities to get some symbiosis of the three plants working together and so got the nitrogen from the peas um, it got a bit of a brassica effect and uh, got about three tons nearly all of it was um, black oats but enough peas and radish to keep us happy for quite a while harvesting our mixed cover crop of black oats peas and radish Got Michael Nichols up there. Here's the spoils of our of our harvest. So we've got lots and lots of black oats, probably about 95%. Uh, we've got peas and then the radish of these small seeds here. So yeah, no, that's that's pretty exciting. Um, some boxes have more peas in it than this, but yeah, it's um, yeah, it should keep us happy for a while. Black oats were the choice because of um, some great qualities. They're quick growing. They uh, like all oats really. Um, they have a great um, allopathic effect, so that they prevent weeds from germinating. And they're probably, as far as I know, they are the best crop for that. Um, the cover crop for that so um, if it's done well and in the right conditions yeah, you can prevent almost all weeds from germinating there will always be some of course um, they have a good nematode um, nematode um, suppression yeah so we think they're going to be a good fit for us um, on our place and um, they are probably the world's most used cover crop just not widely used here. The whole of South America is plastered with them every year. Great erosion control, quick growing.